Hey friends, Sheree here from Sheree's Alchemy. Welcome to Vlogmas Day 21. 21 guys, we're almost done, just three more days. I thank you guys so much for tuning in today. I appreciate all of you that have been watching me throughout the month of December during this Vlogmas adventure, my first ever Vlogmas. I welcome you if you're new to this channel. I invite you to go and, you know, when you have some time, look at all 21 videos so far. Um, if you're watching this at a later date, I did set up a playlist where you can watch all of my Vlogmas. Try to do a little bit different where it wasn't just about vlogging my day, but really trying to bring to you some of the projects that I was working on and sewing and making for holiday gifts, but really they work for all year. But anyway, Vlogmas Day 21, I am here to share with you two things. Uh, one little outfit I made actually last night um, and I'm in love with it. I think it's going to be my Christmas Eve daytime lounge ensemble. I already have a little black cardigan, uh, one of the willow cardigans that I made, um, which is a free pattern over on Blue Fabric. I have a tutorial up on it on the channel, but I think I'm gonna put that little black cardigan on top of this outfit. And that's gonna be my daytime lounge outfit for December 24th. And then I pulled out an outfit. I was thinking about wearing it for day after Christmas for the 26th. Um, and I realized I need to make a couple more. And I can't believe I forgot to include that in my pajama makes video. <laughs> um, and so I pulled that out immediately. I pulled two more fabrics um, that I'm going to be cutting into to make two more of those sets. So I just want to show you that outfit that I made. Actually, around this time last year, it was the December make for an Instagram challenge that I did. Um, and so, yeah, I'm excited to share that with you guys because I think you're going to like it. Uh, so, yeah, stay tuned, stay tuned, stay tuned to see what I'm sharing for Vlogmas Day 21. Okay, friends, so here is the ensemble that I made using the new look pattern for the pants. And I'll pop that pattern up on the screen. And then I use that simplicity t-shirt pattern that I am obsessed with for this top. So I think this is just going to be a super comfy, <laughs> cute little set. I cropped the pants. Um, if I wanted to run out, I could throw on a black wool coat and some long black boots and nobody would know I have lounge clothes on, okay? <laughs> But I am in love, I am in love. You will see me wearing this, it's so comfortable. You will see me wearing this um, in my December makes video, okay? I'll model it and style it um, and have my slippers on with it and all the things, okay? But I wanted to show you guys this because I had just talked about that pattern. And yeah, it's just a very comfortable, quick and easy pair of pants. Now the original length was not as cropped on me as it looked on the pattern. I don't know, that model must have been like over six feet tall because I'm five foot eight and they were full length pants on me cut, you know, per the pattern. They were not cropped like that. So I took off a few inches to make sure they were cropped on me. And then I made no modifications to the top. Um, I made the one with the gathered sleeve at the shoulder and then the little sleeve band. And it's just perfect, perfect, totally comfortable elastic waist pant is doing all the things for me. Okay, so yeah, I really like it. I really like it. I should have pulled out my new, I got a new uh, little handheld thing that'll help me stabilize my iPad better when I'm recording like this with my hands. Uh, I find that when I hold it really stably, I was putting my hand over the microphone. Some of you probably noticed some of the audio issues in Vlogmas. <laughs> Vlogmas has taught me to get some gear, <laughs> get some gear that's going to help make this um, videography easier, Cherie, and so I did. So I got a lot of new toys and actually, oh my gosh, so many toys that I'm looking forward to playing with over the break. But anyway, I'm going on and on. Let me get to the second project. Okay, guys, here's the second set I'd like to share with you. I made a robe and a pair of pajama pants using the Pine Cove pattern from Itch to Stitch. 
I lengthened that top into a rope and I made the pants as is. And then I made a tank top using one of my favorite Berta patterns. Here are the line drawings for the Pine Cove pattern. And next I'll share a little video I made. Happy New Year, Instagram friends. This is Cherie here from Cherie's Alchemy. And I just wanted to show you guys how much I love my new lounge set using the Pine Cove pajama pattern from Itch to Stitch. I lengthened my top to make it a robe. Um, and then I used one of my Berta patterns to make this tank top to layer underneath of it. These pajama pants are perfect, perfect length, perfect amount of ease. I just love it. Um, so thank you to all the folks at Sew Your View for making this the December challenge. Thanks to the host this month, uh, all the ladies over at Sew Sorority, and that's so Monica. And if you need new PJs, I'm telling you, check out this pattern from Itch to Stitch. It's, it's really great. All right. Okay, that was me being super corny for a video that I put up on Instagram uh, earlier this year. But yeah, I love this set. I'll be wearing it on the 26th, and I've pulled two fabrics to make two more. Okay, friends, so I hope you like these two projects that I shared today. Let me know in the comments what you think. What do you think about the fabric choices? What do you think about the patterns that I used? Also, let me know in the comments if you think this is something that you might want to make for yourself or as a gift. I know it's kind of late now, you know, <laughs> Christmas is around the corner. It might be too late to make for gifts. It might be too late to make for yourself to wear over the holidays. They come together really quickly. I mean, I promise you, they are pretty fast sews. Uh, well, I'm a fast sewer, but I feel like they are accomplishable um, in a short amount of time. Uh, so if you do have fabric, I know the one pattern is a PDF. I bought it as a PDF. Um, I know the one pattern is a PDF, I, the Pine Cove. Uh, pajama set. I bought it as a PDF. Um, the other pattern you would have to run to the store or the other two patterns you would have to run to the store to pick up. But anyway, if you don't think you could get it in made before, if you don't think you could get it made, you know, before the end of the year, I do think if you like this style and if you're all about that comfy cozy at home, but still looking cute, I think you should add these patterns to your two sew list for 2020. I'm definitely going to be making more of both of those and we can sew them together, okay? Two pieces of housekeeping to take care of before we leave this Vlogmas Day 21. If you entered my giveaway, please look at the video where I said, you know, winners announced, did you win? To see if you won and to reach out to me. I have no way of reaching out to you. Um, and so I need you to email me to claim your prize. My email is sharizalchemy, all one word, at gmail.com. You can also find it on my about page, okay? Um, Cherie's Alchemy, my channel name, but it's all together. No letters or characters or spaces. Just type all the letters out together at gmail.com. I would love to get you your prizes. <laughs> I've heard from a couple of you, but I think there's still three people that I haven't heard from. So anyway, if you want the prize, please claim it by Friday. December 24th, because I would like to then pull some other names if you feel like, you know, you don't want the prize. I still have all the names and I would just pull some other names because I would like to get these prizes out to people so you can do a little shopping. Um, and then the other thing is I just wanted to um, remind you guys again that my official announcement video for my new channel membership program should drop before the end of the year. I'm not gonna make a commitment to when I'm gonna do it. It's gonna be after Christmas, but I'm not sure when I'm gonna sit and fully edit everything and get that up. But I will get it up before the end of the year because I'm going to start loading things in the membership uh, community tabs that members will be able to get for free. They just pay shipping or they can buy at like, you know, a next to nothing price and they pay shipping. Uh, one of the things that's going to go in there is the surplus of fabric that I used, that pink with the red rose. I got that um, on sale and I bought like 10 yards of it. Um, and I ended up using probably four to five. So I have at least five yards of that left. 
I have nothing else I wanna make with that fabric. So that's one of the fabrics, one of many fabrics that's going to start going up in that membership community portion. I might do some of them as videos, but probably I'll just do posts that only members can see. And then you guys can look through them and you can say, hey, Sheree, I want this, et cetera. I'll put, you know, lengths, quantities, shipping costs um, in there. I'm also, I've already put together some really fun mystery boxes um, that are gonna be super duper cheap that you guys can buy. And basically, the reason I'm doing this is because I told you guys I started uh, going through and pulling out stuff from my enormous stash that I just know, like, I've already made two things with it. I don't need this extra two or three yards of fabric. Or, you know, I've had this for a really long time. It wasn't exactly what I thought it was going to be for that project. Probably never going to sew it. I have, like, a hundred other fabrics in front of it in the line. So I'm letting that stuff go in 2022. I'm also gonna be letting go some sergers and some sewing machines. I mentioned to you guys that, you know, I have an online fabric store, but I also used to have a brick and mortar store. And I still have lots of things that I had, sewing machines and sergers and tools and all these things that I had for classes for 10 people that they're just sitting here. I'm not opening up another brick and mortar store. I'm not going to be teaching classes in my home or anything like this. So I want to release these to my channel members who might need them. Maybe you need a sewing machine or a surgery for yourself. Maybe you have a grandkid or a friend or a sibling that you would like to teach to sew and you could have this extra machine. Maybe you've never had a surgery and you want one. Um, and so it is the year to release those things to my channel members um, so that I can have more space to actually set up all this equipment <laughs> that I need to properly record tutorials, at least for me, the way I want to record them and to present them to you all. I just physically need more space in that room. And I was thinking about branching out into other areas, but I have this enormous indoor garden. And to be quite frank, the room is big enough, Sheree. You just have too much stuff in it. And so <laughs> it is time to release. That's my model for 2022. Let go of these things, send them out into the universe for others to enjoy and to put to use. Um, I have some fabric, actually I donated a bunch, but this is like the good, good stuff that, you know, <laughs> I know I'm not gonna just give to goodwill. And so I would much rather have it be in the hands of someone that I know is actually going to appreciate and use it. You know what I mean? I thought about setting up another Etsy store, but I already have two Etsy stores. I already have two YouTube channels. I already have two Instagram channels. Like. It just didn't make a lot of sense for me. Plus, I know that there are a lot of you that are watching that would really enjoy some of these things. So I say all this to say, the official launch video for my membership program should come out before January 1st. That's my intention. I'll work on that after Christmas, getting all the editing done and get that officially up. But remember, I did wanna go ahead and release to you guys early you can already get in on it because some of these because some of these things I'm going to go ahead and just gradually start putting up before January 1st and it's going to be first come first get. Um, so yeah, and remember, I made that announcement that I had some special box that I was going to send out to the first five um, members that joined at my highest level, the gold membership level. I have two of those items left. And so if any of you want to jump in at the gold level um, and want to be able to get this extra special uh, gift that's going to go out at the end of the month, you still have time to do that. For those of you that joined at the um, lowest level, the bronze level, I will be putting up some things that you guys can also um, take advantage of as well as that middle level, the silver uh, level, that's where you're gonna start to get offered patterns and notions and things like that. It is that upper gold level that I will be offering up um, at really low prices, plus shipping the sergers and the sewing machines and all the good, good fabric. So, and the good, good patterns. So anyway, I just wanted to put that out there in case any of you missed that video and you wanna get on early so you can get first dibs on these things. But I have a lot to work on for those perks and I'm so, so excited to start rolling those out 
starting in the new year. So that's it. That's it with the housekeeping. I hope you enjoyed Vlogmas Day 21. I'll see you guys back here tomorrow. Peace. Thank you.